My name is Tracy Mensch, and I am uh, happy to be here today to share with you a little bit about myself. I have been on the CUC for uh, six years. My term just um, went out, but now I am uh, um, the chairperson for NCI. Um, subcommittee, and um, I'm also, just to tell you a little bit about myself, I have cer cerebral palsy, I'm a mother, an advocate, and a business owner, and uh, about, um, we got together and decided to create an NCI subcommittee. Can you talk about who are who is um, on the committee on subcommittee? Yes, myself, uh, Renee Rodriguez, Christy Franzoni, and um, Joseph Flanagan, um, who is no longer with us. Sad to say. We decided to make the report shorter in friendly language. And so we did that by um, pictures and pie charts and stick people to make it more friendly. And we also um, uh, did, um, uh, we asked people to um, if they would be willing to put their own personal story in there. So one of the tasks of the subcommittee every year is presenting to California's stakeholder uh, meeting. And so this is something that you took part in last year? Yes. Do you want to talk a little bit about that? Sure. Um, last year I was approached and honored to go to a stakeholders meeting and share with everybody about our concerns as a committee. And um, our concerns were, let me start with that first, our concerns were transportation, planning, and work, and wellness. And so I went, in there and told them how much of a concern it was to us. And then uh, the big issue that came up was transportation, of course. <laughs> and um, I tried to explain to them how important transportation is in our communities throughout California. But not only that, all these these um, issues that you see on on the screen. Um, and so, did you just talk with the subcommittee, or did you go out into the communities? Uh, we also went. Sorry, we also went out in our own com communities, and each of the members did, and we found out these were the main issues. At that, at this time, and so you took that information that you talked about at the stakeholder meeting, and you also had a meeting with your mayor. Do you want to talk about that a bit as well? Sure. Um, I went back to my hometown in California, Bakersfield. I don't know if anybody's heard of Bakersfield before, but I went back to my hometown and spoke with my mayor about all these issues. And um, he was very perceptive and we're going to make a change in our com in my community um, and things. So um, it was a really good um, ab ab advocacy move for my community, but others 
Um, we really want this each date to to be able to use the court indicator report that we have created. That's a great segue into talking about the how to use data guide, the 10 easy steps to using data, which the subcommittee is now working on. Um, and that's what you all just got handed that packet. Do you want to talk a little bit about what the guidebook is? The guidebook is um, some of the inf well, <laughs> some of the information that we broke down out of the big report <laughs> and made it a little smaller and, and made it more friendly. Um, and so that's what we did. And of course, we did pictures and things like that, like I said earlier. And Stephanie, is there anything I'm missing? So actually, perfect. Uh, we can talk a little bit about some of the steps that are in the guidebook. So Think Plan Do is really big in California. Do you want to talk a little bit okay. about that? The Think Plan Do. The think is meaning to think about what you're doing. Planning is to make a plan and uh, and do is what we are doing now. And so we have also in the guidebook, I know that you got a lot of information from other self-advocates on the CAC and in the communities. So do you want to talk a little bit about um, how you got the voices of other people into the guidebook? How we got the other voices into the handbook was um, we asked like um, to have people be able to. Uh, we wanted some more voices out there, so what we did was we just asked, and whoever uh, whoever wanted to put a story or. Uh, you know, things like that, then we put it in the, there. Renee is one of the committee members. He, uh, he offered to put a story in there, explain, explaining about his, his experience. And so last question, Tracy, what was your favorite part of being, a, or favorite part of being a part of the CAC? Being part of the CAC and NCI is that we, that I am so proud that we're getting to use this data. I mean, in, a, in the friendly report. And I think that I would be hope that um, people from other states here today will, will, um, look at it and also use it because we're all in this together to help people like ourselves. Well, thank you very much. Um, and I think right now we'll open up to questions to any of our panelists. It went great. I was very um, impressed with all the questions and it just went Awesome.